Hello, this is Andrew Smith from the T155 Linux and Introduction course at the Open University in the UK. Some of you may find that when running VirtualBox and Ubuntu on VirtualBox, you have difficulty in installing updates or apt getting files or using the Synaptic Package Manager. This is possibly because where you're using it has got a proxy server in place which this system needs to get through. This is relatively straightforward to set up so long as you know the name of the proxy server and also the proxy port. This is the TCP port which the data is going to be sent through. If you go to System Preferences and then Cunningly Network Proxy, up will pop a dialog for network proxy preferences. Like most operating systems, it's no different for a Mac or for Windows. It is assuming you've got a direct internet connection. To overcome this, you click on manual proxy connection, configuration even, but on this point you might need to then put in a HTT proxy of my proxy my domain dot whatever dot somewhere. Okay? And the port could be 80 or could be 8080. And you could possibly either be using the same proxy for all protocols or using port 443 or 8443 for secure hypertext, port 8021 or 21 for FTP, and SOCs could be on a range of ports depending on the local system. Some systems will run this on 1080. Others will run this on a different port. I'm afraid finding out the proxy configuration settings for your system that you're using is entirely down to you because the network administrators may have set up something completely different. But once you've set this up, you should then be able to update all your applications and use the Synaptic Package Manager and um, do the security updates that Ubuntu would like. And this is not a problem unique to Ubuntu or VirtualBox. This is the same requirement for any operating system that's running on a network behind a proxy.